Hey, what's going on there, everybody? It is TechWares. Today is September 26, 2024. And the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 5090 and 5080 specs have, have been leaked, all right? This they leaked from a very popular and I guess you can call it reliable and reputable leaker. All right, so the, the GeForce, here, I'll just show you a big chart. Let's scroll down here. So here's the chart. Um, it shows all the upcoming next generation graphics cards. Not all the models, but some of the models from NVIDIA. So NVIDIA GeForce RTX, uh, AMD Radeon RX, and Intel Arc um, uh, Battle Mage, right? So here's 5090, all right? The picture is to be leaked, right? So there's, we don't have the picture of them. The GPU of the 5090, of course, it's using the Blackwell. It's based on the Blackwell architecture. All right, and uh, CMs uh, or CUs, 170. The CUDA cores, uh, 2100, 760. All right, it's going to boost up to 2.85 gigahertz. Memory, 32 gigs, all right? of GDDR7, memory bus 52-bit, uh, memory speed is going to be 28 gigs, um, and here's all the others, uh, so the power connectors, right, 2 pin, 2 16 pins, so that's insane, the default TGP, 600 watts, which is insanity, alright, the announcement date, it is for all these, right? These are all rumors. Um, uh, 2024, right? Maybe like Q4 this year, maybe early uh, next year, which is at CES. All right, 5080. This this is just a long right the announcement. Is not September 2022, but um, oh yeah, yeah. Sorry, these are the 4090s. They're just they're just up here in comparison, right? So, and then you have the 5080, right, and there's specs for that, there's the RX, uh, AMD RX 800, uh, sorry, 8000 series, all right, which is uh, based on RDNA 4, that is also to be leaked, pictures, um, of course, it's kind of expected that NVIDIA is still going to hold the Halo product crown, right, The just like the best gaming GPU, the highest end, right, the top model, also the most expensive, right, come on, what do you guys think the price is going to be, I mean, if the, if the 4090, the MSRP was 1600 or uh, 1599 USD, what do you guys think the 5090 is going to be, um, I'm going to be guessing, I'm, I'm going to be guessing even more, maybe like, I don't know, $100 more, maybe $200 more. I mean, NVIDIA, NVIDIA can get away with it, right? They, they release, all their products are, uh, you know, uh, they cost more than their competitors, and they still outsell them. So uh, the 59 is going to be an uh, insanely, insanely uh, huge price. Honestly, from all these uh, next-gen GPUs, the one I'm only excited about, me personally, is actually the Intel Arc uh, Battle Mage. Uh, the B series, right? If that's even what they're going to be calling it, we don't know. But you know, the uh, Intel Arc Alchemist A series. So, yeah, I'm actually really excited for the Intel Arc Battle Mage. Um, I honestly think there's going to be a day where Intel Arc is going to either surpass AMD Radeon or they're going to match it in uh, performance parity, right? And I think in the future. Intel Arc is going to have better software than AMD Radeon. Honestly, that's just what I believe, um, just from doing a lot of research and just on my own analysis on that. So, uh, future is kind of, future is bright for AMD, uh, sorry, Intel Arc. I think Intel Arc is just going to keep getting better. I mean, they're not going to get worse. They're actually going to get better. The trajectory is just going to be, um, you know, going up. So, I'm excited for that. And as you guys may have heard, um, a lot of rumors that 
well, not really rumors because the, actually the a senior um, at a, AMD uh, they said that AMD is gonna drop like they're not gonna make flagship products uh, going forward. You know, for the foreseeable future. Of course, they might return to make flagship products. And flagship products are like 5090, 5080. Those are flagship products. Um, so this rumor right here with uh, 8900 XT and 8800 XT, I don't think this is true. I, I don't think they're going to release, uh, you know, a so-called 9 series or 8 series card. I think it's going to be like 8700 XT or something. But I don't think they're going to compete with NVIDIA at the high end, which is 5080 and 5090. Um, but that's it for today, guys. Just this is a video to let you know the you know Nvidia GeForce RTX uh, 500, sorry 5000 series, which is the 5090 and 5080 specs have been leaked. So yeah, we'll wait and see. We'll wait for the announcement, which is hopefully uh, in Q4. That is uh, October, November, and December, or maybe early uh, Q1 next year. Maybe at CES, which is in January. Thank you guys for listening. Thank you guys for watching. Take care, everyone. Peace.